Okay, I'm ca I'm came back. Now we want to slice it. What we are going to do is we are going to do a perpendicular frames and using the same this curve. But it's not a condition. Sometimes we are going to use other curve because sometimes this curve lead to an intersection between the frames. So I'm going to make another curve component. Okay. Number of segment. We are going in what tool now we are going to use? Sorry, this will be the page prep section. It created a section along it. Now we are going to extrude it. Extrude. Uh, or offset is better. Offset, offset component buffer fish is better because it creates it because it could make it solid and you could extrude it in both direction. This is going to be the material thickness. And because we extrude it in both direction, the material thickness will be half this number. So we are going to use expression. The x over 2. It is. Mm, we could hide this now. Here is our bench. I think the thickness is 10, 10 cm will be great. We could change the number now. This distance will make sure there is no intersections between the curves. I want to show you something. If there is intersections between the curves, you could adjust the curve, but we don't. Uh, so we are going to create other curve or duplicate this curve. We're going to copy. Sorry. Uh, yes, yes. We are going to copy this curve. Okay. And making it in, changes this its layer. I created an, uh, a new layer and it changes it changes changes its color to cut diaper it between the direct the main the main curve which we created the shape the shape using it to create the shape. The curve and the curve that we are going to adjust, adjust the slicing direction. Just you go to properties and go to layer, change curve. Okay. Now we could adjust the control point. Look, if we change this. Okay. Oh, this is embarrassing. Okay, sorry. I didn't 
choose this curve in here. Okay, we are going to choose this curve, set one curve, choose this curve. Okay. It is really messy. Control Z here. We are going to move it this. Now we could adjust this curve by, by changing the direction. But like, but here in this case, I am going to leave it as it. As it was. And inserting. Okay. What is this? Here is the problem. now we could adjust the number this number until we are satisfied with the distance between the sections I think 75 will be okay this is really great I think it's okay until now. Okay, so there's other things that you could do is making a reference rule here for fabrication. Okay, I'm going just going to make this group. Making a reference hole, it, uh, we could use this the same this curve. Curve. Alright, I'm not new. I'm going to use move tool. And I'm going to move this curve. Zero. Okay. Okay, it's fixed now. What is this? Delete this. This. And delete this. Sorry. Okay. Here is our curves. Maybe we'll let them add the same. Now we're going to use pipe. Tool. For. I'm not going to move this, leave it at the same elevation. Apply for this. And for this too. But the vibe radius is going to be. Oh. There's a problem in valid value. So I was going to be think oh point oh one one four. It's okay. Oh no, it's really too small. Point one. I think this is okay. Oh yes, there is other things that I have forgotten. We could extend this curve to make sure that we are going out from here. Going to Extend curve. So we are going to connect all of this. This curve and this curve. I 
I'll say Google Codex Lens them by 0 0.1, 10, 10 cm. At both directions, for both curves. I think this is great. Okay, what we are going to do now? We are going to subtract a solid difference. Solid difference. This from from what? this I'm just going to bake this so to make sure that this become right sorry uh, think there is a problem oh yes yes now I have forget to flatten this at the pipe. Really, I am. I'm okay. Make the the type of the cable make it flat. I will do this now. Okay. Okay, great. Look, it is very great. Okay, what we are going to do now? Sing. Grab. Five. Here. Bench. This is our main ingredient. Okay. Uh, okay, now we are done. And really, there is a lot of control in this. But if we are going to change something here, it is better to turn at least this part, turn it disable to make your computer change, pro change the process faster. We could really make this R hide this and starting. I am going to move this part here. Now we could starting defining this part change now just more and more I think it is really cool now You could edit the direction of the curve and it will change directly. Good. For this. Oh, sorry. If you are going to change the direction of the curve, you will going to change also the, po the slicing curve. You should change both of them together to make sure that the, that the wool bench is going to be set. Oh, I'm go now, okay, let's, let's try. There is a problem. Okay, there is a problem. Okay, let's fix it now. There is intersections here. 
as I told you, if there's intersection, you could edit the, this curve. Oh yes, some curves couldn't to be real. They are not here. That's it's okay, no problem. I'm going to increase the control point to have more control in the curve. Starting adjusting it a little bit. Okay, here is some data version field. Just have to see like this. This time that conversion field also. Okay, it's pretty cool. I think this is enough today. Now we could, after after adjusting everything and the, then and we are satisfied from the sh final shape, we could came here and turn this part enable and bake it and render. Oh, sorry, I forget. Oh, yes, yes. Right, uh, you are came here and right click, choose big. Here he saying to you, uh, do you want to make it group? Say yes. Choose a layer, let it the default. Okay. Now go to, came to the bench, pick. Hmm. It's layer default. Okay. Now you have your bench. 